Chalsa, a small town situated at the foothills of the Himalayas in the Duas region of West Bengal in Jalpaiguri district. It is surrounded by hills, numerous tea gardens, rivers and dense forest. The flora and fauna and wildlife associated with the region make it a preferred tourist destination. Nestled in this beautiful backdrop by the side of NH31 is Chalsa 132 KB substation, one of the oldest and critical transmission substations of the region. The substation was established in the early 1960s by the erstwhile WBSCB with the primary objective of evacuating Joldaka Hydro Project's generation to load centers. This substation is easily accessible by air, road and railways. After unbundling of WBACB, Salsa substation was inherited by WBACTCL, the state transmission utility in April of 2007. With a view towards achieving improved voltage profile and load management, as well as to strengthen connectivity and reliability, this substation was augmented with 132 by 33 kb transformation system in the year 2009 and has since been functioning as 132 by 66 by 33 by 11 kb substation. As part of the current organizational structure, Chalsa 132 kb substation is functioning under the technical and administrative control of Jalpaiguri Area Office of WBAC TCL with Transmission Zone 3 and Transmission ONM1 being the subsequent higher levels of hierarchy. At present, Chalsa 132KB substation is connected to the grid via 132KB lines from Moitnagar 132KB GIS and Moinaguri 132KB substations respectively. The installed transformation capacity at the substation is 63 MVA, each at 132 by 33 and 132 by 66 KV, while the capacity at 33 by 11 KV level is 26.3 MVA. One of the primary objectives of this substation is to evacuate the generating power of Joldaka Hydro project via 66 kb Joldaka double circuit transmission lines. This transmission link is the single connectivity of Joldaka Hydro project with the grid. The Hydro project has the installed capacity of 44 MW of Joldaka stage 1 and stage 2 combined. Chalsa 132 kb substation also evacuates hydro power at 11 kb generated by Neura Small Hydro project. Chalsa 132KB substation caters power via 66KB lines to Otlabari, Nagrakata, Kalimpong and Banarhat 66KB substations. It also caters power via 33KB lines to Malbazar, Latakuri and Gorubatan 33KB substations of WBAC DCL. Additionally, power is also catered to local consumers by 6 number of 11KB feeders. Considering the importance of 66KB system at the substation, the age-old 66KB control and relay panels were renovated recently. Work included incorporation of modern supervision scheme, rewiring, installation of new relays, meters, etc. To further improve flexibility and redundancy of the vital 66 kb system, a second set of 66 kb PT has been incorporated in the system. The 11 kb system at Salsa is extremely important as it feeds power directly to the numerous resorts and places of repute which is frequented by VIPs and dignitaries. In order to improve reliability and keeping in mind the increasing load demand, third 33 by 11 kb transformer having the capacity of 6.3 MVA was added to the system recently. As part of ongoing efforts in WBC TCL for increasing the redundancy and robustness of the control system, second sets of 220V DC and 30V DC system has been incorporated at Salsa. The battery bank and battery chargers are well maintained. 132 kb grid connectivity will be reconfigured in a major way in the future whereby the existing 132 kb Mohitnagar circuit will be terminated at Moinaguri resulting in 132 kb Chalsa Moinaguri double circuit lines. Further, as part of future vision, power to the upcoming Kalimpong 132 kb, Malbazar 132 kb traction and Sevok Rangpur rail project are to be catered from Chalsa. Additional renovation of 66 kb system is planned to be carried out in a phased manner by replacing age-old, trouble-prone and under-capacity isolators. To improve system availability and reliability, we follow a mix of time-based periodic and condition-based preventive maintenance strategy keeping in view the guidelines of WBSE TCL. To achieve our objectives of high availability and reliability, we utilize departmentally provided state-of-the-art monitoring and testing equipments like TAN Delta Test Kit, Leakage Current Measurement Kit, Circuit Breaker Timer Test Kit, Infrared Thermovision Imaging Camera, Digital IR and PI Kit, SF6 Leakage Detector, Voltage Detector, etc. Routine tests like DG Analysis 
has been introduced at nearby testing area offices which has reduced the turnaround time for our results. Advanced techniques like furan analysis of transfer oil has also been mandated by WBAC TCL and is being followed by us in a phased manner. Time-based periodic maintenance of substation equipment as per maintenance schedule is done and standard operating procedures are duly followed. One of the major challenges in the region is the difficult terrain of the transmission lines, especially at 66 kb level. These lines go to dangerous wildlife areas, hence extra precaution like carrying firecrackers and protocols like giving prior information to the forest officials are followed. To ensure high availability and reliability, periodic line patrolling, route clearance, jumper checking and tightening, insulator checking and replacement, theft member replacement, foundation checking and repairing, etc. are done for all lines at regular intervals. Record keeping is done by a mix of online and offline modes. Different type of Excel files, registers, records and files are maintained regularly and are kept in the control room. System book, battery, shutdown and breakdown registers, permit to work, daily inspection book, yellow card of transformers, maintenance checklist of various equipments, drawings of equipments and control and relay panel etc. are all maintained. Safety manual, maintenance schedule, switching instruction and standard operating procedures are readily available at the control room for our reference. There is also a section in the wall which depicts important information like single line diagram, important phone numbers, fire protection layout and location of fire extinguishers, notice board, etc. At Salsa, the real-time PLCC system is well maintained and is primarily utilized for voice communication with connected substations SLDC and ALDC. OPGW is also utilized for voice and data communication and will also be utilized by the newly incorporated SAMAS metering project. Safety is the topmost priority for the power sector where the primary threat that we are dealing with is invisible. We the family at Salsa 132KB substation take safety as a precursor to our job and not as an afterthought. The suitably placed indoor and outdoor safety signages serves as a continuous reminder to the danger at hand. Periodic safety awareness meetings and firefighting mock drills are also conducted. There are sufficient firefighting equipments, fire extinguishers and sand buckets placed strategically at different locations of the substation and periodic checking of fire hydrant system is done to ensure proper functioning. Personal protective equipments are readily available in the control room, for example safety helmets, hand gloves, gum boots. ARC flash suit is also provided, especially for 11 kb control room. First aid kits are also available in the control room and are routinely checked and replenished. Bay marking and phase marking is done adequately in the switchyard. Salsa 132 kb substation has sufficient illumination all around the substation. Maintaining the illumination of the substation is done by checking and replacement of damaged lights on a regular basis. At Salsa, we have a store and stack yard for storage and safe keeping of valuable equipments of the substation. In order to provide an eco-friendly environment, pleasing view and to minimize industrial radiation, efforts are made to keep the substation premises green and clean by planting of seasonal flowers and plants and periodic de-weeding of unwanted grass and shrubs. Residential colony and security barrack at Salsa 130 KV substation is well occupied and the residents form a part of a well-knit family. Salsa 130 KV substation is well guarded by security personnel around the clock. In the cultural aspect, Vishwakarma Puja is celebrated enthusiastically every year in the substation and is hugely appreciated by the locals, who eagerly look forward to the day. In our leisure time, we involve ourselves in sporting activities like badminton and cricket to keep us fit and refreshed and also to avoid dullness at work. We are a well-knit group of people working at Salsa 132 KB substation who believe in teamwork to ensure a pleasant and satisfying working environment as well as a better tomorrow. Salsa 132 KV substation stood first as the best performing substation in the category of old 220 KV and 132 KV substations for the year 2015-16 and we wish to repeat the same feat once again.